way the joint locks works is that if you resist counter to it, it hurts you more. Do you understand? Yes. 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 So first if I did the S lock right here, right? If he tries to stand up, stand up. Stand up. See, that's making it hurt more. So you can't go against it. What you have to do is go with it. I would slow it down a little bit, but as he pushes in, control the hand and twist. Now look what I got. <laughs> He's moved in. I didn't get it in time here. Then I'm gonna just go under it here. Stop it from here. The hand is palm faced up. Understand? Then from here, if you don't want to get in and control his fingers, then you could just easy out. From here, I'm gonna take it. Inside. So he's going to take me this way, stop his hand this way, or here. One of the things I risk in doing that, he's going to grab me. He's going to grab me like that, we're on a date. <laughs> <laughs> we're still on a date. <laughs> <laughs> right. Once you got to this position, you got some control. I'm going to go ahead and take my right leg, get my right shoulder out. And you have to be careful. This position, you got to slip right or else he's going to get a headlock. Do we have to worry? No, this one is great. Here it is. Grab his hair. The back. He's still holding on. Contain. Keep it locked. Here it is. And then hold. Press the wrist. Press the wrist. This lock. Lock it up. Then we can get to this hand. Bring it back. Continue to crank. Let's say he does do that. And what's my counter? What am I going to do? I'm still going to hold this. Stop away. Kick. 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 Stop. That gives you your opportunity. Not out here. Hip in. And I'm reaching backwards. Head up. And lift. And fall. Better. Understand? Sir. Here it is. Just step it over. And fall back. When you did the arm bar for self-defense on the street, I'm going to use this to pound and I'm going to put my foot on his face and do the arm bar. Try to pick him up from here, but it's a little harder, better, have it here under, and then lift. He pushes out, see, there it is. And push. Take the elbow, I step out. Now I step out. That's, he, that's what gets it right there. Bump. Over. Arm in. Step back. Push up. Put it in the bicep. Pin his head down. With the pressure point on the neck. Squeeze. Press. One. Stop. Step. Arms a little bit. Ooh. If I pull, go bend. If it does, what do I do? Just go right into This is better if I go ahead and bump. Because he's moving this way, right? And that shoulder lock, these are this is one of the easiest things to get out of. And because most people do it wrong. Holding my elbow is not out into the space here. And then you step back and move. I'm not gonna bridge back. That's what I'm gonna do here. He has no choice. Boom. Okay, finger for it. Tuck. You want to get away. You don't think about turning in. You got to turn into him. In this position, there it is, bam. If I step in and take it this way, I can go ahead and step in here. If you want to get earlier, reach. One, two, there it is. Control this. The position is, it stays still, stays there. And I enter back in again. Grab the top. There it is. Push. 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 